Little tail, clearing the wingtips. Now, to steer, this doesn't work, okay? Yeah. All with the feet, alright? So left foot forward, we turn left. Right foot forward, straighten up. Right foot, we turn right. Left foot, etc. And if you use the, Victor, you use the two, top of the pedals, the pedals one eight, zero one those are the brakes. So I can use left brake, right brake, okay? So feet on the pedals now. And you've got to follow this yellow line, okay? Yeah. And ideally, try and keep it between those marks there. So you have the rudder now. Yeah. So a little bit more to the left. Left foot forward. Left foot forward. That's it. Keeps going straight. That's it. Now come to the right little. You've got to anticipate the aircraft a little. Yeah. So straighten up. That's it. Come around a bit more to the right. Straighten up. A little bit to the left. Don't kill the crows. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> the wind is trying to turn us to the right anyway, so left foot forward now. We need to slow down a little bit, otherwise we'll get told off by the tower. <coughs> Got a bit of a tailwind there. Right, so a little bit to the left now, and then once you're on that yellow line, straighten us up. That's eight, entering the hold 5,000 feet. Billing 63 Alpha 1 ready for departure. Billing 63 right turn VFR clear takeoff 170 degrees 12 gusting 22 knots. Right turn out clear takeoff Billing 63. Okay, so we've now been cleared for takeoff, so we can use the phrase. Hands on, so just join me on the controls, two fingers and a thumb. Just rest your feet lightly on the pedals, but not on the top of the pedal, which is the brake. So just make sure your, your feet are further down the pedal, not touching the, the brakes. Okay. I just slow us down a little bit. We turn onto the runway. First thing we do, we check if we've got the right runway. Runway 21. People have lined up on the wrong one before. <laughs> okay, and controls into wind. So feet off the brakes. Full power applied. We check full power's developed. T's and P's are all good. Airspeed's live and increasing. Easing off the ailerons as the speed builds up. As we get to 55 knots, easing back on the controls. And we're airborne. And you see we're flying almost sideways. Yeah. <laughs> and you look at the balance ball. <laughs> so if I push the right rudder in, I get the ball back in the middle. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I want you to try that now. You have control. So just ease back on the controls. Nose pitch is up. Centre the control. We're in a pitch up attitude. Converting speed into height. Now he's forward again. Nose pitches down below the horizon, turning the height back to speed. Now ease back to put the horizon on. Uh, ease forward a little bit, come a bit too far. Just use a bit of control now, just to hold that very murky horizon just on the compass there. I'll just level the wing swinger. Okay, there we go. So that was easy. <laughs> now we're gonna scary. <laughs> now we're gonna look at the aileron, okay? Okay. I want you to try that to the left now, so we check in the opposite direction, all the way around to your side. You have controls, so controls to the left, aircraft rolls to the left, keeps rolling to the left, centre the control. And now you get that yawing yeah. moment as the nose slips to the left. Okay, level the wings up. Six eight, report 4 DME, on the go around, standard missed approach. That's good. It's very difficult without a when it's so murky, you're doing very well, making you work very hard. <laughs> That's good. Now you can see we're coming down a little bit now. We just ease off the forward pressure. Oh, a bit turbulent. <laughs> As we get close to the ground, I start bringing us wings level, pointing down the runway. So we go one, nice. two, three. Now 
Oxford 68, base turn complete. I wanted to get down before Oxford that. Oxford 68, report 40 on the go around, standard missed approach. Okay, so we're going to report exit on this first one here. It's got to close, and now you can pull the mixture all the way out, please. Yep. And that cuts the fuel to the engine. Now we know. Put it down? Or? No, no, le always leave it out. Um, now we know the engine is perfectly safe. When we Once we've got the key out, it's safe electrically, it's safe fuel wise. Okay? Master switch.